Welcome back. As I mentioned before the break, we are now going to talk about solo travellers. Are you a solo traveller? Uh, Debbie, what is it about flowers? Business is booming, isn't it? Yeah, it's lovely at the moment, blooming. <laughs> yeah, excuse the pun, yeah. <laughs> it's been the home of the Rugby Football Union. It was actually where the Rugby Football Union was formed. Look at this. It's the self-stirring mug. It's quite incredible. How does it work? Well, you can hear it, but we'll get to the motor inside shortly. But first of all, how does it work? Well, if you take off the bottom here, you can see the batteries. There they are. Helena from Sweden. My name is Tony, and I would like to give you a bunch of flowers, a bunch of roses. Thank you very much. Are they making you happy? Yes, very, very. <laughs> Thank you very so, much. Do you like buskers? I have no idea what it is. It's also been a Canadian embassy, a Texas cantina. Music. Do you like busking music, sir? It's wonderful. You love busking music. Where are you from, sir? New York City. From New York City. Well, welcome to London. All right, girls. I'm, I'm Tony. I do an A to Z of gags and impressions. Which, in short, means if you're a solo traveller, you will be able to enjoy a solo cabin on a ship with a balcony. Uh, X has got to be X Factor. It's time to face the music. Competition time with Derek and Adina. Each of you will have 20 seconds each. You must not say yes or no. There must be no repetition and there's no nodding of the heads. If there is, if you break any of the rules, you will hear. <laughs> and you don't want to hear that. And now more recently has been converted into luxury apartments. Tommy Cooper. <laughs> I went to the doctor the other day. I said, have you got anything for wind? You give me a kite. <laughs> and they start at £4.7 million to an eye-watering £25 million for a penthouse. And that is smooth sailing. What does that mean for you? It means that you can have your own cabin, not feel like you're isolated. 